What is up, what's up, what is up, FS Club? Welcome back to the channel. Well, mods are out. Hopefully, you guys are on amazing weekend. Back to mods on Monday. Well, today, guys, on consoles, we got the Crimpy TW800, the Case International 6200 pack, the Lizard Missouri 61100, the Lizard 65116, the Planner, the Brander TA3800, the Lizard Cannibal pack, the Lizard Pat Rear Bucket, the Biogas Plant 450KW, the placeable KS67 grain silo, the Karchner HDS C915, and fence back. Now on updates for today, we got the Lizard NL series, the Linear Unit Track Pack, the New Holland T5 Utility Series, the Mossy Ferguson 8700S, and the Lizard Car Trailer. You know what? Let's just roll that intro. Let's get these new mods. Here we go. Okay, now welcome back. The first mod to go over today for the week is the Crimpy TW800. Let's see, it's $57,000, 10 slots, holds up to 46,100 liters. Uh, let's see, options on this one, we got rim color, we either got gray or finch red. Design color, we got red, gray, green, or finch green. Main color, red, green, or finch green. Extensions, we got standard extension, which is 40,000. The extension, which is 46,100, and then back to standard. Will brand, we have Michelin, we have Nokian, and then back to Michelin. Design, we have trailer. Can I go down there? Oh, that's weird, it won't let me go down there. Hmm. Yeah, I can't go down there for some reason, so I guess that's it on this. Let me know if you guys are having the same problem too. There is the Crimpy TW800. Okay, and now we have the next one, which is the Case International 6200 pack. Let's see, includes this one right here and the dual one. Let's see, this one is six slots, $46,500. It does hold up to 1,450 liters, 80 horsepower is required, and 4.3 working meters for this one. Options though, we got red, we got red and white, we got the IKR yellow, the IKR yellow white, and then back to red. We got old tires or new tires. Pretty neat little seater right here. I hook it up right there, or you can basically drag it right there through that trailer. Uh, the bigger one, though, there's that one. It's $95,000. It is, let's see, 12 slots on this one. Holds up to 2,900 liters. 130 horsepower is required. 8.7 working meters. Uh, let's see, options. We got the red, the red and white, the IKR yellow, the IKR yellow white. Uh, and then back to red. We got old tires or new tires on that. So that is the Case International 6200 pack. And now on to the next one, which is actually right next to the case. It is the Lizard Missouri 61100. Let's see, it's $21,000. It is seven slots on this one. 2,200 liters it can hold, and this only does seating. Let's see, there is no options for this one. Pretty nice, though. I think this thing also comes with a triangle, which I don't know where that would be. Maybe under weights? Nope. Um, Maybe miscellaneous? Let's see. Mm, yeah, there it is right there, the Missouri Lifter. So it does require this one. It is $800 and three slots on this one. Options though, there is no options for that one. Okay, and now we have a new truck. This is the Lizard 65116. Let's see, it's $56,490. It top speed is 55 miles per hour. Let's see, 210 horsepower. It is 35 slots on this one. Options though, we got main color, pretty much yellow, blue, orange, cherry, white, red green and khaki uh we'll set up we got standard we got standard 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 okay a bunch of standards you know what? let's actually take a look at this in game okay and so here we are in game let me actually turn on the help window there we go okay let's enter it okay i didn't see anything Ooh, i like that looks really nice inside wow so two cameras uh let's see horn and that is it on that. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's see. One lights, two lights, three lights. So three sets of lights. Uh, those beacons at the top, it doesn't look like it. Because I can't get them to light up. Okay, let's turn the engine over. Ooh, nice engine sound. Can we be quiet so you guys can hear the engine? Okay, top speed is 55 miles an hour. Let's go in here, let's see this. Everything all lights up. Dashboard all lights up. Turn signals. Pretty nice. 
Everything moves. Yep. Okay, 55 miles an hour. I'm a bit quiet so you guys can actually hear the engine running. Okay, pretty nice little truck. Okay, let's go over here and park it right here. Yeah, it's pretty nice. You can actually see stuff if you look really close, like the fan moving and stuff in there. Okay, so that is the Lizard 65116. Okay, now the next one we have is this one right here. This is Planner. $3,500, 2.2 working meters. Uh, let's see, it is only one slot. This is a leveler, or you can use it, of course, to push your grain. So there is no options for that one, though. Okay, and now we have another trailer. This is the Brander TA3800. Let's see, it's $33,000, 14 slots on this, holds up to 55,000 liters. So uh, let's see, options though, we got main color, we got green, black, or orange. Uh, let's see, configuration, you got standard, which is 33,000. You got extension, which is 55,000. Then back to standard on that one. Uh, Will Brand, you have Lizard, Nokian, and then back to Lizard on that one. So that is the Brander TA3800. Okay, and then the next one to that one we have is the Lizard Chernobyl Pack. Let's see, includes three things right here. We got this one, which is the Chernobyl, which is 1500. Let's see, two slots on this one. Main color, you can either do black or white. Uh, design, you have white decals or black decals. And then we got the, it looks like bale forks right here, which is two slots, $500. Uh, options on this one, the same thing. And then we have the Pence uh, one, which is, let's see, two slots on this one, $750 on this. Let's see, we got the main color, either black or white on this one. Okay, so that is the uh, Lizard Chernobyl pack. Okay, now the next one we have is this one right here, which is the Lizard Patch Rear Bucket, which is $3,500. Four slots on this one is 500 liters is what it can hold. It does require 75 horsepower. Options though, we got main color, we got red, gray, gray dark, green, or gold. Brand, you got default, you got old. And then back to default. What you do on this, you put this thing on the back of it and it acts like a bucket to pick up stuff, which is pretty neat right there. Okay, so that is it of the regular mods for today. Of course, we did get some placeables, so let's go over those placeables real quick. Okay, so for the first placeable for today, we have is the Biogas Plant 450KW, which is 54 slots, $365,000. It is $225 a day on that. So let's go ahead and put this down real quick. So there it is right there. So really nice, and if you are on PC, it does have the manure system on it. So that is a plus right there. So you bring in your silage right there, and it goes in there, and you make some money. I believe you get your digest date from right over there. Uh, but this, yeah, this is a pretty nice little model right here. More manure system hoses, it looks like. Okay, so that right there is the Biogas Plan 450K Debbie. Okay, the next one after that one is we have a new grain silo. So let's go over to here. There it is right there, the KS67 grain silo, which is $250,000, holds up to 400,000 liters, $45 a day, and this pretty much holds your basic crops. Uh, let's go ahead and place that real quick. Wow, you can actually hear it. Okay, so let's put that right there. So there it is right there. Wow, these are nice. Okay, so it looks like you can get your grain out through there, and you dump it right through there. Actually, sounds like someone's shoveling. So, really nice. I don't see no light switch or anything like that. Is that a bell? Almost looks like a bell. Okay, and then after that one, we have is a new wash area. This is the Karchner, I believe that's how you say that, HDS C915. 10,500, eight slots for this. So let's go ahead and place this real quick. So let's put it right over there real quick. Okay, so there it is. It is just, of course, you get the hose out and you can spray down your vehicles. So really nice. Okay, the next one and last new mod for today is a fence pack, which I believe is under decorations. And there it is right there. We got fence post, fence 1M, fence 2M, fence 4M, fence 12M, fence 24M, fence 48, then gates. Wow. These are all looks like one slot on each of these. So let's go ahead and place down maybe a few of these. Let's place down that. Let's place down that. And let's place down. Well, that is a big one right there. Okay, really nice detail though on these. Uh, let's go over to the gate. Does it open? Yes, it does. It's a really nice gate. 
Okay, so that is it of the new mods and placeables for today. Let's go over, of course, those updates for today. Okay, and so the first update for today is for the Lizard NL series. What did this change? New colors, new engine options, new tires, improved interior, chassis options, and animated antenna on that one. So that was for the Lizard NL series. The next one, linear unit track pack. What did this change? Improved models, added normal textures to all models, and manure system support for PC. So there's that one. After that one, the new Holland T5 utility series. The change log on that one. Minor bugs fixed, base price reduced, front weight option added, and beacon lights are optional now on that one. And then after that one, the Mossy Ferguson 8700S, the uh, change log on that one, let's see, new colors configurations, new little details, new body colors, new interior design, and agri bumper fix on that one. And then the last one, the Lizard car trailer, what did this do? Added cover on this one. Okay, so that is the updates for today. Okay, guys, so that was, of course, the updates. That was the new mods, placeables. That was everything for today. Today's schedule after this video, I will try to get out of FS Daily News, but no promises. Uh, let me know down in the comment section below, guys, which one was you guys' favorite mod. I'm probably going to have to say probably that Lizard C65116. Today was kind of a slow day, but it is Monday. Remember, guys, if you guys did like the video, make sure you guys do pound that like button. If you haven't said, make sure you guys do, like always, have an all day, farmers. Peace.